Hello everyone, welcome back again. My name is Jesse and in this one of tutorial, we're trying to see how to detect languages with spaces. Now let's see how to do that. So first of all, you just have to install this particular package. So there are two different packages that can help you to detect a language. You can use pip install spacing cld, right? Which is based on the pi cld from Google. And then we have pip install spacing lang detector, right? So you can use any of these packages. So let's use the first one and see. So after installing, just go with import. We increase it. Go to import spacey. Go to import spacey. Then the next thing we're going to do is that we're going to import our package that we built, right? So our language. So we're going to load our language. We're going to be from our spacey and as for cod, which we installed above, import language detector, right? So that is the next thing. Then we're going to create our NLP object. So it's going to be NLP, it's going to spacey, but load here. Then after loading our creating our NLP object, we're going to add our language detector, which we have imported from spacey underscore COD as a pipe, right, into our NLP object let's be there. So that's the second thing. So it's going to be addition of it NLP dot add underscore pipe. We're going to add our Particular language detector, right? That's what they're going to add here. So let's see. Let's first of all create it in a variable. And let's call it as language detection. Then language, right? Then initialize it first. Then just place it here. So that's the next thing we're going to do. So language. Perfect. So we have we have added it to our pipe. We have added it. To our NLP objects, right? So now we can use it to work on any other thing we want to do. So let's create an example. So docs is going to be NLP. So we're going to supply in our test. So we can use any code or you can just go straight away with it. So let's say he is or let's say he works in London, something like this. So in case I want to detect the kind of language, it's quite simple. I just go with my docs dot underscore. Dot right, remember that in the preview one of the tutorials we learned that if you add any extension, any plugin to the NLP object, you just use this particular format mm -hmm. to, to assess it, right? So, language dot language, so right? it's going to detect the particular language, which is English, which is very, very interesting, right? That is the best way so to check for the accuracy of it. You can just go with the same thing of dots dot underscore right language scores. Then we supply the language that we had, which was here, and we'll tell us the rate, which is 95. So it is 95 percent sure that this is English. So let's change it to something different. We're going to give it something totally different, because English, but totally different language. Although this model is English model, but we're trying to see whether to be to detect a different language altogether. So example two, docs two, then this is going to be something different. So let me change it to Russian. Let's Type in a test from Russia. So honorable type is in Moscow, right? He works in Moscow. If I go and analyze this particular stuff, in case I want to check for the particular language, the same command that I had here is going to tell me that it is Russian, as we already know, right? So two are you right, which is Russian. So in case I want to check for the score of it, I'm going to use the same thing that I had here, which is two. Yeah. Then I can supply. They are you. This is ninety seven percent sure that this word on robotize on the most clear is Russian. So that's how to add language detection to space. You use species language detector to help you to detect languages. So thank you for watching. In case you have any question or contribution, you can just please the comment section below. The same procedure is with the same language detector. Right, so you're going to just install it, import it, and then initialize it. Right in this particular format, they use it. It's the same API, the same format. So thank you and stay blessed.